Welcome back to our channel from Open Pen Innovation Lab, Bangalore. I am Divya, one of the managing partner and chief instructor of this company. Coming to this week's topic, all these years we understood the topic of what is machine learning, at least what are the things going on with deep neural networks, what are all the advancements happen. Obviously everyone knows what is data science, at least you are aware with the common term of that. And slowly we also started moving towards quantum computing, how qubits have been manipulated and how they can be realized through quantum circuits and simulators and all. Now, we will have one more question. Can these kind of classical data can be run on quantum computers? If yes, how it can be realized? So, this kind of wild guesses give rise to more interesting topic that is known as quantum machine learning. Like, share and subscribe. We post new content on this channel. So, let's dive into the topic this week. Topic for the week Quantum Machine Learning Like, Share and Subscribe We post new content every week How AI and Quantum Computing are connected? Quantum Computing can provide the power needed to run complex algorithms. Quantum Computers possess tremendous potential for handling large data sets that are often used in AI experiments. Quantum Machine Learning is the integration of quantum algorithms with machine learning programs. To summarize in a more easier manner, there are four different approaches to combine quantum computing and machine learning. First thing is we have to differentiate whether data is classical data or a quantum data and whether algorithm runs on a classical computer or a quantum computer. The diagram summarizes that. So our quantum machine learning is built on two concepts. One is quantum data and the other is hybrid quantum classical models. Quantum data is any data source that occurs in a natural or artificial quantum system. This data exhibits superposition and entanglement. The quantum data generated by NISQ processors are noisy and typically entangled just before the measurement occurs. Heuristic machine learning techniques can create models that maximize extraction of useful classical information from noisy entangled data. TensorFlow Quantum Library provides primitives to develop models that disentangle and generalize correlations in quantum data. We see how machine learning methods can be done using quantum approach. Certain algorithms like K-nearest neighbor, support vector machine and k-means clustering. It can be done using quantum approach by efficient calculation of ca classical distances on a quantum computer. Neural networks and decision tree are the first explorations of quantum models. Bayesian theory and hidden Markov models they help in the reformulation in the language of open quantum systems. So after going through certain things, how to get started with the quantum machine learning? We have Circu, an open source framework or Qiskit programming which is developed by IBM or even we can use Julia programming language. So which is your favorite? Let me know in the comments below. So Circu, it's an open source framework for programming quantum computers. So it is also a Python software library for writing, manipulating and optimizing quantum circuits and then running them on quantum computers and quantum simulators. Whereas Qiskit, it is an open source software development kit for working with quantum computers at the level of pulses, circuits and application modules. Qiskit provides a set of tools for composing quantum programs at the level of circuits and pulses, optimizing them for the constraints of a particular physical quantum processor and managing the batched execution of experiment on remote access backends. These are some of our references what we used for today's topic. So if you know anything else, please let me know in the comments below. Like, share and subscribe. We post new content on this channel every week. Thank you.